Hi, John Tagger here with Stragget Media. This morning we're in downtown Louisville in Umbrella Alley, where they're going to be chalking the walls for Gallery in the Alley. So come on down and take a look. We're going to be interviewing Jeff Kern today, one of the local artists um, who's going to be doing the chalk on the walls here in Umbrella Alley. Jeff. Hey, John. How's it going? Doing good. Great. <laughs> so what brings you here today? Well, we're uh, doing a little chalk work on the wall, adding some uh, nice color to the, to the alley. Um, brought some uh, friends, local uh, artists, got them involved, and we're going to try to transform this eyesore into something I adore. Okay. Yeah. Um, so, how did you kind of get started with this? What are your uh, your roots um, and your your origin for for all of this? Well, for um, I guess wall art and stuff like that. I, I actually got started at, at when I was at high school in Louisville. I uh, one of the projects there was uh, painting a leopard on the weight room wall, and that was uh, that was old school technique of not using any projection, just drawing it up and painting it as I, as I saw it. And that was, uh, you know, that was kind of a difficult task, figuring out how to put all those spots on the, on the leopard just right. So that was a challenge, but that was an early, early uh, um, outdoor piece or, or uh, yeah, art piece. And then 40 years later, yeah. it kind of just blossomed in what it is now. Yeah, well, it was, uh, Mid 90s, I, I discovered chalk art as a as a neat medium. I was working at John's Bar and Grill in Canton, and uh, started putting Chief Wahoo up on an outside brick wall, and that generated a lot of spirit and enthusiasm, and it evolved evolved into some other other uh, pieces, and and uh, then I got involved with the Arts and Stark program. Uh, the uh, first Fridays they had Chalk the Walk, and started doing that when it first began. Uh, I think that was like 11 years ago. And so I've done a, quite a few chalk pieces on uh, uh, on the ground and on the walls downtown Kent. So here I am in Louisville, back here again. It's like a bad penny I keep turning up again. <laughs> so if you're in downtown Louisville this weekend for the 4th of July, you should stop in Umbrella Alley and check out all the artwork and maybe talk to some of the local artists here. So, Jeff, thanks a lot. We thanks, appreciate John. it. Yeah, look forward to seeing everybody. Hi, Stragat Media here in the Umbrella Alley with Andrew, one of the uh, other local artists. Um, Andrew, uh, how many years have you been uh, doing the chalk art or art in general? Well, the chalk art, I did probably since probably like 2013, 2012. I did it while I was in high school. That's when I first met uh, Jeff too, but art in general, I've been doing for like ever. <laughs> I'm at I'm 25, so that's a long time. So um, did Jeff ask you to come down today or you kind of, um, have you done stuff in Canton before or? I've done stuff in Alliance in Canton before. This is the first time in Louisville. Uh, a couple weeks ago, Jeff told me about it and he was like, hey man, you wanna join up? And help with it. I was like, sure. So if you're in uh, Louisville this weekend, stop down to Umbrella Alley and uh, take in the sights. Hi, John Taggart here with Stragat Media. Today we're in downtown Louisville in Umbrella Alley with Mary Ann, one of the local artists um, doing the chalk art on the wall. Um, Mary Ann, how long have you been doing uh, chalk art? About five years. Um, what kind of what got you started in the chalk art and um, how you ended up here today? I got in touch with some people at the Carnation City Festival. They were doing it there at the Rip Burnoff, and I wanted it in on it. So that's how I got. I just found the right people to ask and got involved. Um, so you got the flamingo here, and then you're going to be doing the wings as well. Angel wings, yes. Yep. Going to put some depth in it, some background, and some shadow, and make him look like he's popping out to greet you, put his arm around you, and say hello. So it's both both over interactive art. So if you're in downtown Louisville this weekend, stop out on uh, Umbrella Alley. 
John Taggart here with Stragget Media. We're in uh, downtown Louisville in Umbrow Alley. Uh, we're here with Iris, uh, one of the local artists. Um, and uh, you got a uh, butterfly here that you're... This is my project for today. So I'm just working on the interactive butterfly for the alley, so... Um, so how long have you been doing uh, chalk art? Um, this, I'm more of a paint artist. I usually do murals, but um, Jeff asked me to come out and work with them on the chalk stuff. So I've done a couple chalk things, but this is definitely the biggest chalk piece that I've done so far. So, um, how long have you known Jeff? Um, and how long? I mean, this I'm actually I, this is actually the first time that I've met Jeff. I met him through um, kind of the directors of the alley. So he was kind of looking for a few other artists, and I was going to be already doing the mural that we're going to do, a permanent mural on that back side of the alley. So Rayanne, one of the main people of the alley, directed me to Jeff and kind of got me in on this. So that's how I met him. So, yeah. so if you're in uh, Louisville this weekend, stop down to the alley and check out all the artwork.